What's up, YouTube? Here with the start of this mail day week. Today's Monday. I got five TTMs today, so really, really good start to the week. That's probably around what I've been getting for a total for a whole week is maybe five to ten. So to start uh, this week off with five was really awesome. All successes, uh, complete successes, everything I sent returned and signed. Uh, so we'll get started with the first one coming from Santa Clarita, California. Took 18 days. This is an untested address on Star Tiger, uh, which has now been updated as success. This is Mallory Mackey. She's an actress and model. Signed my index card. To David, thanks for being such an awesome fan. Love Mallory. This is a blow up of a bench warmer card. To David with love. This is a cover of a magazine. With love. This is a shot of her. Just sign that one. And this one says, To David, thanks for being awesome. Uh, this is a shot with uh, her and a bunch of other females and Hugh Hefner. So I thought that was a cool shot. So next up, coming from New York, New York. This is also an untested address. This is funny because back in September, uh, I met this actress. 243 days untested. This is actress Samantha Mathis. She signed my index card. And she signed, I believe, five photos. Here's a Super Mario Brothers. It's kind of hard to see because she signed it in dark. You can kind of see it. Signed a American Psycho movie poster, a Punisher movie poster, a shot of her. That's more what she looks like now. And a shot of her as Princess Daisy from Super Mario Brothers movie. So, really happy to get her back. Next up, this is a quick return from Santa Barbara, California. Took 12 days. This is actor William Daniels. Signed index card. Signed this cool Knight Rider custom. Signed it on the hood. He uh, played with the voice of Kit. Here's a shot of him now. Here's a shot of the control from Kit, signed down bottom there, and a little cast photo from Boy Meets World, he signed right beside himself. So really cool to get him back, especially for the Knight Rider stuff. Next up, coming from No Clue, because it's uncancelled, 59 day return, this is Playmate Christian Nicole. She signed all of my 5x7s. There's one. Two. Three. Like that one. And four. Sorry for the glare. There you go. Didn't sign uh, the index card or book plate, but that's cool. And last one coming from No Clue. Did not stamp it, but they did scratch it out. This is a big bubble mailer. It took 17 days. Sent out two of these, uh, both uh, female MMA fighters. This is uh, my UFC glove. So she signed it right there. Unfortunately, signed it in black, not on that pad there in silver, which is a lot of where they sign. This is Cat Zingano, CZ. So pretty cool to get it back, though. Happy to get it back. Uh, don't not sure if I'm just going to do one on these or try to get maybe two or three. I'm not real sure. I sent the other one out to Ronda Rousey, so we'll see if I ever get that one back. All right, guys, so that's it for today. Nice start to the week. Let's see what we get tomorrow. 
All right, and for Tuesday, I got in one magazine and one TTM. The magazine is an ESPN magazine with uh, Kansas Andrew Wiggins on it. And the one TTM is coming from Rancho Park Station in Los Angeles, California. It took 17 days. This is finally wrote out for the first time to Elliot Gould or Gold. Uh, he's an actor. Sent him both my Ray Donovan 8x12s. Already signed by John Voight right there. Elliot signed it in character and described it Ezra. So that's a cool dual piece now. And also sent along this, even though he's not pictured on it. There's John Voight, Mickey. And he signed it right back in the back. Elliot Gold, Ezra. So that's cool to add to the Ray Donovan piece. And I also sent him two DVD covers. One from Ocean's 13. Signed that one right there. Uh, the character inscribed it, Ruben. <clears throat> and a Blu-ray from American History X, already signed by Ethan Supley, right there. And Elliot signed it right there. So, cool dual signed. Alright, and for Wednesday, I got in a bunch of stuff. One Listia win, two eBay wins, one Autograph World win, and three TTMs. So first up, the Listia DVD is Hannibal. Finally picked that one up for the collection. The two eBay items, first up, I got the first season base set for Game of Thrones. So now I got first season and second season, so I can start busting out TTMs with both sets in one envelope. The other eBay is the True Blood card that the guy forgot to send me the first time. He sent me the other six, Lauren Bowles. So he kept those word and sent it off. The Autograph World, staying on the True Blood theme, is an 8x10 of Tara Buck. So another addition to the True Blood collection. <clears throat> and the three TTMs, first up, coming from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Tried him one more time, but he's still charging. Sid Bream needed him for the set. So I'm just going to have to send him like five bucks. I'll send him the 8x10 uh, of him sliding into home plate uh, when he was on the Braves. And uh, that card there. Next, TTM coming from Santa Clarita, California. This took 100 days. This is actress Simone Bailey. She signed index card. Nice signature with a little heart. A movie poster for Good Luck Chuck. And then four photos of herself. First one. Second, third, and the last one. So really cool success there. And the last one for that day, didn't know what the heck this was, <clears throat> coming from Czech Republic it looks like. Uh, it's, a, it's a big envelope to my old address, so I really didn't know who this was. But Veronica Balova, uh, she's an actress. Uh, it hasn't done much, but she was in Hannibal Rising. She's also an artist and a photographer. I uh, just actually emailed her asking her, like, hey, do you have a P.O. box or an agency that I can send to? And next thing you know, in the mail, I got, like, here is... I don't know if this folds out or not. It feels like it does, but I guess not. And the tribe, she signed that. So she just randomly sent me stuff. Sent me this here. It says, please like my art book on Facebook. And this folds out. And I see a bunch of her, like, she does a bunch of, like, almost like horror-related photography. You can see. I'm not sure. If I'm guessing that's her or if she took this picture. But two days with love, she signed that, so 
pretty cool. But I, I wanted to send her like photos from Hannibal Rising and maybe DVD covers. So success plus it was for free, so that's always cool. All right, and then today, Halloween, I got two Listia items, and I did get a TTM, so at least one TTM each day this week, so hopefully that continues up for the next two days to finish off the week. And the Listia DVD wins is The Born Identity and National Treasure. So two more additions to the DVD collection, and both those I'm going to be using for TTMs as well. And then the one TTM today, coming from the UK, Royal Mail, took 127 days, 8 by 10 return. This has been out there 127 days, but it's a cool one. <clears throat> Sent back my old school Clash of the Titans DVD cover, signed it right there. This is Claire Bloom, signed that. Clash of the Titans 8 by 10 sign that and she's pretty much notorious for send, signing like just one maybe two but she signed all three Clash of the Titans movie posters she signed it right there down the side so that's awesome really really happy to get that I'm a big huge Clash of the Titans fan especially the original one I used to watch this movie at least once or twice a year when it came on TV uh, and the new ones are pretty good as well so all right, guys, that's it so far. Still got two days. Let's see what happens with those. All right, and in today's mail, Friday, I got two magazines, a bunch of DVDs from the same seller, basically my monthly order from this guy, and one TTM. The magazines, Us Weekly with Chloe and Odom on it, and pretty cool one, Entertainment Weekly with the beautiful Katy Perry. The DVDs picked up some old but good ones. Turner and Hooch. Jason Goes to Hell. The Thing. This is an awesome one. Uh, the Poseidon Adventure. This is like the special edition one. It comes with these lobby cards which are pretty cool actually like hard like postcards so that was awesome picked up Texas Chainsaw 3D then some Blu-rays I got Wanted 12 Monkeys and The Zookeeper the TTM coming from the UK took 53 days this is actor Harry Lloyd from Game of Thrones, signed my index card. One shot of him. Another one of him. Here's his death. And a Game of Thrones movie poster. So, awesome return to the clip. Uh, addition to the Game of Thrones collection and some DVDs as well so hopefully we'll get some more stuff in and we'll finish this video out with some TTMs tomorrow alright and to finish off the week I got four TTMs all successes first up Honolulu Hawaii took 23 days this is 1970 Miss June playmate Elaine Morton signed the index card Signed three photos of herself. Here's one right there. She signed in pen, so it's kind of hard to say. Another one here down the side. And the third one, again, down bottom in pen. And she also signed a book plate, which I stuck in. Playboy 40 years and it is that one right there Elaine Morton Miss June 1970 so another one to the book next up from Santa Clarita California took 22 days this is adult film star Summer Cummings 
signed index card signed this photo here signed another photo another photo and the last photo next up from North Texas dog 96 days this is actress Emma Bell from The Walking Dead she signed the 4x6 great to meet you with me her meeting and she signed three DVD covers Hatchet 2 which was already signed by Adam Green she wrote David thanks Emma Bell Final Destination 5 she signed in blue it says uh, you can you can't escape it with a character inscription kind of hard to see because it's in blue and then frozen which was already signed by Adam Green as well she wrote David stay warm Emma Bell and the character inscribed that as well so really good to get those back last one coming from uncancelled stamps 12 days this is Steven Lisberger Tron the original 8x10 signed he's got a really nice signature and another Tron 8x10 from the new remake or whatever and then he always throws in 1981 trading cards from Tron sent me two more of those so that's it for this week got some more stuff going out hopefully some more stuff coming in talk to you soon peace